Yeah, so we be here. So who we are? Quienes somos nosotros? Somos Billet the Boys. We are Billet the Boys. ¿Qué estrategia usamos nosotros? Which strategy we use? We use DeLorean family. The DeLorean edition, specific by language, okay? So I, I want to know who's here are new. ¿Quién, quiero saber quiénes aquí son nuevos, okay? Who's new here? Put one in the chat. What's up, my man, David? Put one in the chat if you knew, okay? Please, put one in the chat if you knew. Nobody's new? Okay, ha estado conmigo ahora. Okay, it's your first time getting the training with me. Put one in the chat, please. Quiero ver si tú es la primera vez que estás haciendo el entrenamiento conmigo. Pongan uno en el chat. Okay, put one in the chat. And also, let me know, guys, everyone, if you can hear me clear. Déjeme saber si puede. Pon uno, uno, uno en el chat. Pon uno, uno en el chat si tú me escuchas bien. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. That's all. Okay, good. So let's go straight. Este entrenamiento, this training, is going to be bilingual. Va a ser bilingüe. And also, también... Va a ser basado en básico, base and basic, and advanced also. Basado en básico y avanzado. So what we're going to do, ¿qué vamos a hacer? We're going to explain the strategy normally. What you see right here, vamos a explicar la estrategia como tú la ves ahora. Also, I'm going to go, that one I'm going to do quickly. Eso lo va a hacer rápido. Because you're getting those training when Jimmy and Tony Ustedes tienen ese entrenamiento con Jimmy Tony. Then, I'm going to focus a lot. Me voy a enfocar mucho en how to find a nice setup. Voy a enfocarme a cómo encontrar lo que es, eh, cómo buscar los buenos setup. ¿Ok? So, vamos a hablar de la estrategia primero. Ok, let's go straight to the strategy. Nosotros somos billetes boys, so... Lo primero que tenemos que tener, the first thing we have to have, we have to do is a plan, a trading plan, okay? Lo primero que tenemos que hacer es un plan de trading. Tú necesitas saber, you have to know, cuál es tu por ciento con tu cuenta. What is, what is your goal when you account? Tú necesitas saber cuál es tu, tu meta con tu cuenta, okay? You, can, you cannot be trading. You cannot be joined to one account like to one session, tú no puedes entrar a una sesión sin saber cuánto tú tienes que ganar. You don't have to, you cannot get into a session if you don't know how much you have to make. Okay, how much you have to make, cuánto tiene que hacer, how much you have to risk, cuánto tiene que arriesgar, and how much uh, you have to lose, in case you lose. I, I want to be real here. You got to estar eh, real aquí, bro. So you have to know this. If you don't know this, te va a pasar como a mí me pasaba. It's going to be like the way it was to me. I have something here. I don't know what it is. Uh, eh, te va a pasar como... Bendito. Te va a pasar como, 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 como a mí me pasaba, que yo ganaba y perdía. Ganaba y perdía, ganaba y perdía. I was winning and losing. Winning and losing. My account, it was like a roller coaster. Mi cuenta estaba como una... Que no iba, no iba ni para atrás ni para adelante. Iba más, iba más para atrás que para adelante. So... I want you to, what I want you to do, to, you have to know what is your trading plan. ¿Quién te va a ayudar con el trading plan? Who's going to help you with the trading plan? Well, your leader. El leader tuyo te va a ayudar con the trading plan. He's going to help you with the trading plan. If he's not trading, so looking for somebody. Also, we can do it here. You can go to the, this page, the quarter 421, and then you can put your amount here. Whatever amount you see in your account, if cualquier, tú puedes ir a la página que se llama forex, forex21.com. Pone tu monto aquí, aquí pone el por ciento por sesión, por sección. Ahí dice mes. Here you can see months, but you can put a session there. Like whatever amount here, you put like a session. So tú puedes poner session. Y aquí tú vas a poder ver cuánto tú tienes que hacer. Then you're going to see how much you have to make per session. Cuánto tienes que hacer por tus sesiones. ¿Sí? Eh? Okay. So that's a trading plan. That's a basic. Tony explain this all the time. Tony and Jimmy explican eso todo el tiempo. No quiero enfocarme tanto en lo básico. 
I don't want to focus a lot in the basis because basis basis, okay? Y those of you already trading here, cada uno de ustedes que ya traen aquí, uh, you already know the basis. Muchos de ustedes ya conocen lo básico, okay? So, normally we risk between 1 to 3%. For in every single session, nosotros arriesgamos de 1 a 3% de la cuenta en cada sesión, en, en, perdón, en cada trade. And also, we look for if the account go down 5%, we're done for trading. And if the account go up 8%, we good, we're done for trading also. Si la cuenta nosotros perdemos el 5%, se va, cerramos la computadora. Y si ganamos el 8%, también. Eh, but okay, punto. This is the point here, family. Do not pretend if you win the five percent or three percent or four percent, and we don't. And you see the market is crazy when the news. Do not continue trading. You made your money. Like you made two percent, three percent, four percent. I. Tú hiciste tu dos por ciento, tres por ciento, cuatro por ciento. Si tú ves que el mercado está loco, tú ves que Tony y yo, y Jimmy, you see Tony and I and Jimmy, sometimes we say, family, we're going to go 2-0. Oh. Vamos a, va, va, a veces decimos que vamos a ir 2-0. And then we're done. Y, y llegamos y, y terminamos. Why? Because we're seeing the market crazy. And another thing, let's say, when my 2%, myself, yo, mi persona, I'm only looking for 2% per session. Yo solo busco el 2% por session. Okay? Why? Why I do that? Because I make several sessions in a day. Yo hago varias sesiones en el día. Para mí, para mi equipo, for me, for my team. Okay? I do normally six sessions in a day. Why? Because I know how to trade it. Yo sé cómo tradear. Okay? That's why we teaching you. We want to teach you. Te queremos enseñar a ti a, 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 a pescar. Okay? We want to teach you to fish, in, not to get the fish. Okay? Por eso que estamos haciendo tu entrenamiento. That's why we're doing this training. Okay? So let's go, let's continue. So for now, let me know if you go when the rich management. Let me know if you are ready with the rich management. Put one in the chat if you're ready with the management. Put one, let's go, 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 let's Okay, <laughs> let's go. So now you have to watch the news before you, you get it. Look, everything I'm doing right now is before you get into session. Antes de tu entrar una sesión, the first thing you have to do is know your risk management. Lo primero que tiene que saber cuál es tu manejo de riesgo. Also, you have to know what is your new, the news day, your new session, okay? La, la noticia de la sesión que tú estás. You have to know what's going to happen and based on the news and the time you're going to be trading. Tú vas a tener que saber, tienes que saber, cuando tú vas a tradear, qué está pasando en el mercado en términos de noticia. You have to know that. So, red folder, we had the two hour, I can say low risk when you got red folder. Te puedo decir que te vaya bajo riesgo cuando hay folder rojo. Folder, los tres folder. Cuando you see the three folder like this, even red, yellow, orange, no matter. Gold, Low risk, okay? If you clean, you can go between two to three, okay? Where you see that, donde tu mira esto, in Forex Factory, okay? Forexfactory.com, you can see this, like this, you see? Orange folder, puede mirar ahí, folder amarillo, folder rojo, folder naranja, orange folder, right here, yellow folder, okay? So let's go, let's continue. So, pongan uno a uno en el chat, Pongan uno uno en el chat si ya entendieron lo de la, lo de la, lo de la noticia. Come on, come on. I'm waiting for one. At least, at least one tell me. Yes, I saw the news. So. Forexfactory.com. Let's go. Ahora los cuatro pasos de la estrategia. The four step for the strategy, which is simple. That's a basic. Esto es lo básico, familia. Ahora, después de ahí, vamos a pasar a lo avanzado y ahí voy a tomar más tiempo. So, the first step for the strategy, ya ustedes lo han visto con Tony and Jimmy. You can see it with Tony and Jimmy, simple. Four step for strategy is like this. When you're looking for buy, the X represent uh, blue and the uh, Y represent uh, red, okay? 
N when this uh, cell X represent red and uh, J, I think it is, or Y, represent blue. So let's talk about this. Step number one, paso numero uno. When you see the arrow, cuando tú miras la flecha, tú vas a mirar la vela, en este caso estamos buscando compra, we can see, we can, we're looking for a buy, all right? So when you see the arrow, looking for the candle X, which is blue, if it's bigger than yellow, which is red, yes, it's bigger than yellow, let's see. Yes, it's bigger than yellow. Look at the arrow right there, it's bigger than yellow, yes. Second step, segundo paso. Give me a second, I got a question about the news right now. En la noticia te sale una moneda, entonces, y, y entonces aplica todo lo que los pares que tengan esa moneda. Ah, uh, yes, así es, Marjorie, yes. But you don't, it's applying toda la, todos los pares que tengan esa moneda, but you, all you have to do, todo lo que tienes que hacer es irte bajo riesgo, ¿ok? Bajo riesgo. The question was, family, in the news happened in this currency. Let's say right here, let's go back to the news. Let's say here you got euro, euro, red folded all day. You see? Tú tienes el, 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 el euro folde rojo el todo el día. So what you have to do, que tienen que hacer? Every single time you can be trading any pair has that currency. Cualquier momento que tú vayas a tradear cualquier par que tenga, ese par, que tenga esa moneda, tradearlo bajo riesgo. Okay? You trade low risk. Okay? Let's go. So, uh, no, you know what? Uh, let's talk about something here. <laughs> the fourth step is easy. Porque quiero enfocarme mucho en lo, en, lo, en, lo, en lo avanzado. I want to focus a lot in the advance. So the fourth step is easy. Everybody know the fourth step. Put one one in the chat if you know, if you know the fourth step. Yeah, also, also, Majori también dice, si tú quieres también no puedes tradear. Si tú quieres que tú miras, no miras cero, no trade también. So let me know, everybody here, I got 18 people here. If you know the full step, put one in the chat, let me know. B-S-L-S, B-C-L-S, yeah, that's right. Bigger cut, location, and space. That's right. Look, the way you define the fourth step is the way Alitia did. Bigger cut, location, space, okay? Grande, cortar, locación, y espacio, okay? So let's go straight to the to the bands, family. Vamos derecho al avanzado. Hold on. Yeah. So who see my screen right now? Put one in the chat if you know the full step. Put one in the chat if you see my screen right now. Let's go. So I'm going to focus how to find a nice setup, okay? Yo me voy a enfocar a cómo encontrar un buen setup, okay? Let's find a good setup right now. So let's see this. I point it right here because this is a nice setup. Puse esa flecha ahí porque eso es un buen setup. Why? Remember, in HFX, and lo que el HFX, we're looking for yellow line price. Okay, estamos buscando por la línea amarilla, el precio de la línea amarilla. Okay, so also we combine, write it down. I want you to write it down this.
I'm gonna put it right here. I'm gonna put a red color. I'm gonna put a red color. Let me see a green color. Yeah, I got a red color. Okay. How to look a nice setup. First step. One. Number one. Look in the shot. Okay. Two. Currency. Strength. I think it's like that. Meter. Eh, medidor de fuerza. Medidor de fuerza. Chart. Mirar el tiburón. Ok. No se preocupen, yo lo va, esto va a estar grabado. This is recording family, ok. Three. Yellow line price. Yellow line under red line. If is for sell. Ok. Y lo inverso si es para compra. Uh, línea, línea amarilla debajo de la línea roja. Ok. Para vender. Y lo inverso si es para comprar. Always. Todo el tiempo. For, by the way, for, for looking for AGB setup. Okay, I have it. And number five. What? Okay. Five. We call it counter trend, okay? I think it is like this counter trend. I think it is. Ya le voy a explicar de eso. Okay, so that's the point that I'm going to be touching. Uh, in this training, okay? I'm going to be touching those things in this training. That is, I'm going to have to There you go. Okay. Okay, eso es lo primero que vemos. Lo, the first thing we have to look. Lo primero que tenemos que buscar es 
looking for the shark. Cuando yo busco un setup, yo miro de un solo. I look at one, like one, like this. Looking for the shark, open. When the shark is open like this, I'm gonna explain to you right now. Let's say I'm looking for sale here. Hold on. Okay. Hold on, I'm coming. Right here. When I look this, cuando yo miro esto, Right here, the chart, the green line crossing down the red line, it means the chart is not on the water. Si estoy buscando una venta y yo miro la línea verde cruzó y está abierta and it's open between red line and yellow and, and also, let me put the color yellow line, by the way. I like yellow line to be one color code. By the way, the, the setup for the stochastic, el, el, el setup del estocástico, the setup for the stochastic is 4, 14, 3, 3, okay? 14, 3, 3. And to change that setup, all you have to do is just go here. Normally, cuando tú abres la plataforma, when you open the platform, you don't see it. Tú no lo mira. But then, if you click here, you're going to see it. This look like a boxer on top of it. Like, parece como caja, okay? You see, like, show me object three. Like, el, el árbol de objeto. Then what you do, you scroll down. Tú le das para abajo. Then you're going to see a stochastic, normally 5-1-1. Tú vas a ver normalmente el estocástico como 5-1-1. I'm going to answer those questions. Give me a second. Eh, entonces, aquí, right here, what I do, normally this is one color. And here, normally, it becomes like area, like this. Okay, what I do, I put this to line, okay? I put this to line and I change the color. The top one is gonna be yellow. This, okay, the top is gonna be yellow. And then the K is yellow, the D is red. La K es amarillo, la D es rojo, okay? Then let me see if I can save by default. Let me see if I can save by default. Yes, save after default. Salvarlo como está ya hecho. Okay. Then you're gonna have this like this. So you see how yellow line here and yellow line here. So you're gonna look the same thing. Ustedes van a buscar lo mismo. You see, here you got red line. Here you got red line. You see the cup here. You see the cup here, it's the same thing. And then you're gonna get the yellow line price. But the question is, how you're gonna get the yellow line price? Simple, you're gonna go here, where it says setting right here, setting, format. Then you're gonna go to where it say, uh, let me see. Yeah. Not there, sorry. Right here. Setting right here in the bottom. You're gonna go to say symbol label, no, symbol label, no. Symbol last value, no. Indicator last value, okay? Indicador, ultimo precio del indicador. Then you put it, then you're gonna have, that's the yellow line price right here. You see the yellow line price? Ese es el precio de yellow line. Okay, so where I went, donde fui? Right here. Okay, indicator last value. Indicador, 
eh, el último valor del el último valor del indicador, algo así. You click, oh, I took, it, I took it off. So let me put it back again. You see, indicator last value, click, boom, yellow line price right here. Okay? So the first thing, let's look for the first step. What is the first step? Look in the chart, mirar el tiburón. When I say that, the charts mean lo que quiero decir con el tiburón, si yo estoy buscando venta, if I'm looking for sell, the yellow line cannot be on top of the red line. Si yo estoy buscando venta, la línea amarilla no puede estar arriba de la roja. Okay? You have to be below the red line. Tiene que estar por debajo de la línea Roja. That's why when I say, family, the chart is on the water. It's me, yellow line is on top of red line. Okay? If you're looking for sell. Si estoy buscando una venta. If you're looking for buy. Si busco una compra. O un norte. A north. Remember, we look, we're using now the candle symbol. North. South, East, <laughs> we're, we're using those things now. So if we're looking for North, we just buy. Yellow line have to be on top of the red line. La línea amarilla tiene que estar arriba de la línea roja. Okay? If not, I'm going to say, Tony o yo vamos a decir, el tiburón. The shark is on the water. Do not get in. No entre. Okay? So let's let's talk about. Let's talk about let, let's check the news, by the way. Look, the news no, but <laughs> la, la, la pregunta. Let me see the, the question here, okay? Uh yeah, baby line. Baby line about Okay, kind of trend. Okay. 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 Well, no te preocupes. Uh, let me see. Guayver Castro, no te preocupes si no se te ve igual. Yo tengo un par. Okay. All you have to do, Guyver, cuando tú entre, let's, let's go back to DeLorean. Okay. I'm going to teach your family how to, when you open DeLorean, le voy a enseñar a ustedes, cuando ustedes abren DeLorean, what happens? Like you open DeLorean here. Before the session, you open DeLorean. <laughs> Let's go, Alicia. So, so when you open DeLorean, it's like this. That is the DeLorean opening when the first time you open it. Cuando tú abres DeLorean, es así que aparece. Let me wait a little bit here. Okay. So what am I going to do? ¿Qué voy a hacer? Voy a decir estrategia. I'm going to say strategy. Strategy, estrategias, hyperdrive. Click, hyperdrive. Right click. No. Right click. Left click. <laughs> Ana, ya voy para allá. Okay. When you hit the right click, you're not going to let me because I'm already logging right. Oh, man. Se me borraron los puntos. Ah. The point already deleted, but it's okay. Ya ustedes lo saben. So, look. 
I'm going here, right? For the first time joining before the session, that's what I do. Antes la sesión, yo chequeo noticia, chequeo todo. I'm checking the news before the session. I know my risk management, I know everything. Hyperdrive. That's why when you see Tony's doing the thing, cuando estoy haciendo las cosas, when I go in, I say, whoa, let's go. Looking for this one, let's go straight, boom. Hey, what's going on here? Okay, I got a little issue going to hyperdrive now. So what am I gonna do? We're gonna stay in DeLorean. Que voy a hacer, me voy a quedar en DeLorean solo, just for the training, okay? Let's look for here for Eurochef. Okay, Tana, ya voy a responder esa pregunta. I'm going right now to do it. So look at this. Let's say this is hyperdrive. Let me put this like a hyperdrive. Five minutes. Hyperdrive is away five minutes. Five minutes. Okay, five minutes. So what am I gonna do right here? You see this? I'm going down to here, which say, show the objects tree, okay? Aquí dice, muestra del árbol de objeto. I click, I'm gonna go, you see the stochastic say 511? Miren que el estochastico dice 511? I'm going click. I'm going to put, voy a poner 14, 14, 3, 3. Okay? That is in inputs. Eso es donde dice inputs. In style, in estilo, I'm going to change K for yellow. I'm going to put it like stronger. Stronger. Yellow. I'm going to put big. And area. I'm going to change to line. And they say area. Yo lo voy a cambiar para líneas. So D. El D. Yo voy a poner rojo. I'm going to put red. I'm going to put it stronger. I'm going to change area. Voy a cambiar area for line. Then I got the chart. Say after four. Salvado. Ahí. I got the chart. You see the chart? I hit the chart. This is the chart. So. Let's look for a nice setup. Vamos a buscar un buen setup. Then to train you. Okay. Okay. Look, I got this here. Let me see. Yeah. So I'm going to do this setup. This setup right here, they call it counter trend. Yo le llamo count, eh, contando el, la tendencia. Counter the trend right here. This it up. Okay? I call it counter the trend. Le llamo con, con la tendencia. Okay? With the trend. So sometimes, algunas veces, It's not very good definitely definition. No es una buena definición. I don't like it. I don't like because it's not a good definition. Okay, but we got a setup right here. You can see guys, the setup. Pongan, pongan en el chat. Put in the chat if you can see the setup. I want to know if you guys know what's up. 
Quiero saber si ustedes saben qué es lo que es. A good setup is right here. Pongan uno uno en el chat for the buy. That's right, Alitia. For the buy. Look at this setup for the buy. What I say, cross, cross, okay? Cross, cross, yellow line, cross the, yellow, the red line, up the shot, in the shot. The first thing that I have to see, first thing that I have to see is this, the shot. But also, I'm going to go to finbits.com, okay? Finbits.com. Voy a ir, okay? Finbits.com. Voy a poner, I'm going to put this, this, by the way, I'm going to put this, this, uh, I'm gonna put in the chat this website. I'm gonna put in the chat this website, then copy and save in your computer. Salvo en tu computadora. There you go. Finbiz.com, okay? So the first thing that I see. Lo primero que veo, if you're looking for buy here, Euro cap. Okay, Eurocat, why I'm looking for buy? Because see the yellow line cross up. You see the yellow line cross up, the red line, and I see the shark crossing up. The yellow line and the shark crossing up. It's mean the shark is left. It's, he, he left, he's not on the water. So quiere decir que el tiburón ya no está en el agua. Ya se fue. Okay, family? Yeah, I'm gonna go there. I'm gonna go, Joseph. I'm going to that. Simple. If you're looking for Eurocat, buy Eurocat. It's mean North, okay? Norte. Si yo look, estoy buscando una compra, see el setup. If the setup, if it was for call, you see yellow line cross up here in the chart, yellow line cross up here in the Lorian. I'm looking for buy, but I need to make sure because this is binary option, HFX. Yo necesito saber con la fuerza, when the strength, if I got a strength to the price be up for whatever price that I call. Necesito que el precio mío tenga la fuerza para quedarse arriba cuando yo llamo un precio por tres minutos, for three minutes, or at least for the two rollover also. So what I'm doing, euro cat, which is one, euro is one, cat is two. Okay, euro is one, cat is two. Remember that, euro is one, cat is two. Okay, if you're looking for the buy, si yo busco para comprar, I need, yo necesito que el euro, the euro, need to be stronger, more than you, the, the, the Canadian. Necesita estar más fuerte que el canadiense, okay? So let's go check. Remember, this is past, by the way. It's past. That setup is already past. But I'm just explaining to you. So look at Euro. Let's say, let's say right now, hypothetical example. Okay, un ejemplo hipotético. Euro is here, has 0 0.01 right here. The Canadian has minor 0.03. So who has more? The euro. Why? Because right here is the zero line right here. That's a zero line right here. The US dollar has a zero line right now. So euro has 0 0.1. Canadian has minor 0 0.03. Three. Aquí el dólar representa la línea cero. Todo el que esté por aquí está más positivo que el que está de este lado. Let me take the background. I want, I want you to see this.
I want you to focus in this, okay? So look at this. US dollars right here, all right? Everybody's on the left side or US dollars is stronger than the right side. So one here, two here. So I'm looking for buy EuroCAP. EuroCAP has 0 0.01 stronger than the Canadian, zero, minus 0 0.03, okay? The left is stronger, the right is weak. Simple as it is. So you have to look who has a negative. You see negative, 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 negative. negative. All these are negative. Here are good. The US dollar is neutral. Be careful when they're neutral. He's not a stronger, not even weak. So be careful with that. Pon atención cuando ellos no tienen ningún por ciento, que no está ni, está neutro. So, ten pendiente con eso. eso. Yo he perdido dinero con eso. I lose a little money with these things. So, I don't want you to lose money. Okay. Okay. Alicia said GBP is stronger than NCD is weaker. That's why. GBP is the most stronger one and the most weak is MCD. So if you are looking for buy and I see Euro 0 0.01, Canadian 0 0.06, you see it was 0 0.03, negative. Negative 0 0.03, now 0 0.6. So what I do, and I check the cross up here, I take yellow line price, which yellow line price is right here. I'm gonna put indicator last value, click, boom. Let's say right here it was, I'm gonna tell you, yellow line price, family, yellow line price, family, potential north, 950, boom. You got it? You know what I see? Familia, Euro Canadiense, Bucalo, 950, precio, norte, norte quiere decir comprar. Okay, it's mean buy. You got it? Let me know if you understand, but I, I think I did it good. <laughs> Déjenme saber si entendieron. Joseph, for me, all my money, I just focus in Fimbis.com. You can do also, if you want, you want to be more sure, more secure, you can open. It's up to you. You can open currency stream meter. And also, you can open life chart. And you compare all of them, okay? To lo compara todo, okay? Pues mira ahora, el euro tiene dos. The euro has two. The Canadian has four, okay? One thing that I like about this, the meter and the DeLorean strategy, lo que me gusta de la estrategia DeLorean Look at what I like about DeLorean strategy, better than cash trap. When the currency strain is right, all the line is right. Normally, normalmente, when you got the currency and say the Euro is stronger than the Canadian, normally you're gonna see AGB in the bottom. Tu va a ver AGB abajo. So it's mean all the trend, toda la tendencia están contigo. Because what you see, family in DeLorean is five EMAs, which is telling you that that the trend in five time frames. Okay. The five EMA telling you the trend in five time frames. The yellow line is a 50 EMA in one minute. Let me see. Now, 
no, 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 sorry. The red line is a 50 MA in one minute. In five minutes is a 50 MA right here. In 50 minutes, 200 MA is a 50 MA in 15 minutes. Gracias, mom. Then blue, blue, I don't have blue here. But it's a 50 MA in one hour. Also, you can use currency heat wave, like, like here I've seen people has that. Yeah, let's see it. Están dando resultados diferentes. So what I do, example, Jakumi, Mr. Jakumi, he recommend currency weight, currency weight also. You can use currency weight also. What I recommend to you, myself, Jakumi told me about Finbix.com. I focus on Finbix.com, and every single time that I tell you to buy in billete session, todo, cada vez que te digo comprar en billete session, yo estoy basado en Finbix.com. I'm, I'm, I'm based, I'm based, like, I'm focused in Finbix.com when in my trading session. When I tell you guys buy here and you see the resort, I, I, I can say whatever, but the resort is there. And you see sometimes how we're going five and oh and all that. I just focus in Finbix.com. I got currency way also, but normally when DeLorean, I focus in Finbix.com because it's most quick given the, 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 the resort. You see how chain. How it changed, como, como cambió tan fuerte, tan rápido. You see how it changed so quick between 0.02 and now came back to 0.03. You need to know those information quickly. Tú necesitas saber esa información es rápida. So don't go crazy. No se vayan locos. Usen Finbis.com. Also, later on when the demo, you can use another currency streaming if you want to. But myself, I use Fimbis.com. Yo uso Fimbis.com. Also, when we're going to launch the HFX DeLorean, we're going to have a currency strain meter like this one. Example, look at this family that I'm going to show you now. Mire lo que le voy a enseñar. Exactly. That's what I'm seeing, by the way. Deal would use Fimbis.com. Uh, Jacumi used Fimbis.com. Matthew Taylor, cash trap, before he got the whole cash trap set it up, he was using Fimbis.com also. Uh, I see so many people using Fimbis.com. So deal would make over the million dollar using Fimbis.com. Matthew Taylor, also before he was using Fimbis.com, now he used the cash trap whole, uh, completely. Next basket uses that one too. Uh, I see everybody using it. <laughs> so, I believe a lot in Fimbis.com. So, remember, the chart is this yellow line crossing, red line up. If you're looking for buy, it means the chart left the water. Example, right here. Right here, you see right here? That's not a good setup because the chart is some song. You see that song? When we say red song, when we say zona roja, es que, es que ya ahí, normalmente, normally the chart, the, 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 the indicator drop. Again, back to the EMAs. Okay? So that is a, that is a, a, a trend. This is a nice uh, setup now. Okay, now let me go to the, to the counter trend setup. Okay, let, let, me, let, me, let me answer those questions first. Let me see. Oh, thank you. Así no me deja, no me deja poner el euro acá. Guave, no te preocupes, ya cuando tú te en tu, give me a second family.
Okay, fam. So let me answer those questions. No me dejen trapar el K. Yeah, uh, got it. Cuando el tiburón se cruza la línea, ¿qué es lo que va a pasar cuando se cruza? ¿Qué me está, in qué me está indicando? Oh, te está indicando el momentum. Ok, I'm going to answer the question for Brian. I'm going to be answering for every single question. For Brian, say, when the shark is mean yellow line cross red line up, what is indicating me to do? Well, indicating you and both sides. If you're here, you got the cross up. You're going to look for yellow line price. And here you got the cross up mean momentum. Remember, this, this indicator is momentum indicator. Ese indicador del estocástico es un, un indicador de momentum. It's mean, where's the, the volume? The volume go up, okay? So, es un indicador de momentum, okay? So, eso es lo que te está indicando ahí, que compre y busca el precio de la línea Amarilla, yellow line price, okay? Okay, pero están dando resultados diferentes. Yo ya respondí esa pregunta. The difference is that you have to remember to refresh line chart exactly, but it's good too. Exactly, all the currency trend is good too. They good, but like I say, my spam is from the educator, from I am. Dio Wood, use the films.com. My mentor, one of my mentors, like my friend, Jakumi, used Fimbis.com. He, he told me about Fimbis.com. And, you know, they have resource. So I also pay currency. Yeah. Oh, how to have that too. Jakumi is my mentor. Azur Sons, 50 MA. Let's see it. Uh, los otros son en 15 y 5 minutos. No te preocupes por eso. I appreciate you, Pedro. Uh, the, uh, the date of your time. Yes, ese se, ese se cambia. En, en, en okay, the EMAs focusing from, from 50, 50 EMA right here. So when I say like, if you, you want to know if it, all the trend at every single time frame are with you, todo los, los, lo, la tendencia en una hora, cuatro horas, in 15 minutes, están contigo. Look at the EMAs. When you see the EMA AGB, it's mean one hour, 15 minutes, and five minutes are uptrend. If you see AGB on top of the price, it's mean one hour, 15 minutes, and five minutes is downtrend. So you're good. Okay? So, lo que estaba diciendo, cuando tú mira AGB abajo del precio, Quiere decir que tú en una hora, en cinco minutos, en quince minutos, están en tendencia alcistas. Si están arriba del precio, quiere decir que en una hora, quince minutos, cinco minutos, están en tendencia bajista. O sea, déjame decirte claro. Mírate, enfócate como si eso fuera un río. Look at this like this is a river. And you need to jump it. You need to swim in the river. Focus like this. The EMAs is like a river pressure. Como la, la presión del río. You need to know where the river is going. Then you know how you're going to swim. Tú necesitas saber para dónde va el río para tú saber para dónde va a nadar. If you want to cross the river. You're not going to be swimming against the river. You're going to be swimming with the river and cross. Then you get to your side. Okay, tú vas a nadar cruzando el río y te va a ir al otro lado. So you have to know this. So that's why when you're looking for the EMAs in the bottom, yellow line cross red line, you wait for the pullback to yellow line to swim with the river up. If you, the AGB is on the top, you wait for the cross line, the yellow line cross down red line Wait for the pullback to yellow line. Swim down with the river. Lo apliqué en español. Si las tres líneas AGB están debajo, la línea roja, la línea amarilla cruzó la roja, tú esperas por el pullback a yellow line. Y te van a dar para el, con el río para arriba. 
si las tres líneas están arriba, uh, aqua, gray and blue, tú esperas el cruce de la línea roja, amarilla, cruce para abajo de la roja, espera el pullback a la línea amarilla y nada para abajo con el río. ¿Ok? <laughs> Let's see. Good. Let me see. Ok, another question. Si cuando tiene un setup, puede entrar en, en, el open, en, en el open candle price y luego, según el precio que toca la yellow line, siempre que sea dentro de los primeros tres minutos de la vela. Yes, Yomara. You can do that. Tú puedes hacer eso. Sí, específicamente si tiene mucha fuerza. Ok, si tiene mucha fuerza. La pregunta de Xiomara fue, fue, cuando tiene un cero, puede entrar en un open candle price y luego el segunda vez, por segunda vez, el precio de toque, cuando toque el precio de la yellow line, siempre que sea dentro de los primeros tres minutos. Sí, pero recuerda que tiene que tener fuerza. Have, tiene que tener fuerza. So, let me, let me, let me answer that question in English. Read it to you in English, family. Then you can probably can help you too. Xiomara say here, When you find a setup, you can get in an open price and also get in for the second time in yellow line price. I say yes. Oh, by the way, uh, in, the, in the first three minutes, I say yes. But also to do that, you need to know the currency strand meter is with you. Big, like big, a lot. Because remember, you're going to risk two times. Tu va, tu va regarte dos veces. So you have to know. La fuerza está contigo. Okay? Good. So let's continue. So yellow line is the shark and red line is the water. <laughs> I think I got it. Uh, you're right. <laughs> Yo. That's the way that I define. Uh, no, no, no. Hold on, hold on, hold on. No, it's not like that. <laughs> you said. Look right here. Let me see, let me see again. Yellow, yellow, yellow is a shine line. No, it's in better. Let me see. It's invertido. It's, you have to invert this, okay? Invert this. Uh, yellow line is mean the shard is not in the water. If the yellow line cross up in the stochastic, okay, on top of the red, it's mean the shard is under the water, the red. Look at this, look at my hand. This is red. This is the shard. This is the water. You got it? But when it's like this, this is the shard, this is the water. You see the shard gonna get you, get you, get your money. <laughs> so look at this, look like this, red, is the shot yellow is the water okay ah uh, gracias a mí quiere decir que cuando el tiburón se cruza las líneas viene un cambio de tendencia no no es tiene que ver nada con cambio de tendencia porque a veces se cruzan pero la tendencia sigue hacia arriba eso te quiere decir sencillo es una alerta que no entra al trade que te puede puede es señal de retroceso Somebody say here, so when they cross, uh, you see the shards in the water, uh, that's the trend gonna tr turn around? No, and I say that. What I say is probably is potential pullback for three, la three candle, four candle, five candle, sometimes more than that. Sometimes it could turn around also. But you don't wanna be, like I said, you don't wanna be when the shard in the water, simple. Don't be there. Okay, Pedro, away, give us the hot sauce. <laughs> okay, thank you, bro. Uh, yellow line is donde boya. Voy a hacer mi entrada. Yes, Josiah. Josia, sí. Uh, yellow line is, is your main entrance. Hold on, let me let me mute somebody here. Thank you. Thank you for mute, by the way. Thank you for mute. Uh, definitely, David. Uh, si es comprar sobre el bajo, uh, si comprar, sorry, si, es comp si es compra sobre o bajo line. No entiendo eso, línea amarilla. Y venta sobre o más arriba. Sí, no entendí eso. 
a if the k in the case where the first the first let me see in k where is the first is the stronger when the shark goes south uh joseph uh i had to see this um live sometimes uh i'm not like i said i'm not going against look two things that i not do against the currency strength against the shark sometimes look my main thing let me tell you what is my main thing my main thing is I got two keys. This is the sauce for you, family. Remember all the time I'm giving a training, I do I give you a sauce, a sauce. Te doy, te doy salsa cada vez que, que, que tengo un entrenamiento. Si yo no tengo el tiburón fuera del agua y la fuerza, yo no entro en trade. If you don't have the, the, the shark out of the water, like he going, like, not out of the water, if you don't have the, the shark, for me to get in the tray, the tray, I need the shark. Do like the shark. Need the, oh my God! Let me see how I say that. The shark can't be in the water. Like the shark had to go down. <laughs> Let's put it that way because it's all the way in the water. The shark is away in the water, but the shark. When we say the shark is not in the water, it means me. He not. The yellow line need to be crossed up, okay? And also, I need the. Currency strain meter with me. If you don't have those two things, I'm not take the trade. Simple. I'll wait for the number. Teniendo la fuerza a favor. Exactly. Teniendo la fuerza a favor always. Quiero decir que cuando el tiburón se cruza la línea viene un cambio de tendencia. Ya lo leí eso. We want to we want we want the line to be positioned to say EMA. Right. Is the shark yellow? Got it. Okay. Let's go. So family, no more questions? I think we're done. Who's ready for main money, family? Oh, uh, let me answer one question here. Somebody's talking, somebody was telling me this, this, this right here. Oh, you see right here, all HLC. All HLC. And when this I'm done, con eso ya estoy terminé. Oh, it's mean open price for the candle. Let me go to the candle. Right here, you see that candle? You see that candle? Oh, oh, it's mean open price for that candle. H is mean the higher the price already went. The L is mean the lower the price already went. And the C is the closing candle. Closing candle price. Okay. Closing candle price. So la O es el precio, donde la apertura del precio. La H fue los más alto que fue el precio. La L es lo más bajo que fue el precio. Y la C es donde fue el precio, uh, donde cerró la vela. Ok, family, so with this I'm done. No more questions. So, uh, uh, let me know, and let me know in the chat if you answer those, that question. By the way, for, I think it was Tana made that question. Let me know if you did it. Put a one in the chat, Tana, if you if you answer. Uh, I didn't know about that. Uh, thank you, man. I, for me, it's a pleasure, family, to help you guys. I'm not, <laughs> not the best. So let's go, Alitia. Good. Let's go. So, family, let's close the call. The way we get the boy, close the call. The way we get the boy, close the call. Let's go. One. Let's go, Pedro. Let's shake the bank. Turn up because she pranks. TP gets spanked. Pedro. Better pips by the waist. Bust it down for the.